There are a few things in this world I find scarier than clowns. And when I heard there was a clown motel, I knew I either had to do a video on it or forget it existed. So here's the history and haunts of the clown motel. The Clown Motel is located in Tonopah, Nevada, and was built in 1985, and is built next to the historic Tonopah Cemetery, which has over 300 known graves with victims from the mysterious Tonopah Plague, which stripped through the area in 1902. 14 miners who died in a fire in 1911, and the pioneer residents who spent their years building Tonopah. Paranormal claims of the motel include doors slamming, room keys gone missing, mysterious voices, and some people even seeing the apparitions of clowns walking outside the rooms. Ghost Adventures did an episode on the clown motel. That's actually where I heard it for the very first time. And this is the kind of location that, like I said earlier, you either investigate or you stay far away from. So has anyone here been to the Clown Motel? And if yes, what were some of the things you experienced there? And for the rest of you watching this video, why do you think the Clown Motel is so haunted? Aside from the creepy feeling of being in a place with so many creepy clown statues and paintings of clowns, I think it just goes down to the whole, the atmosphere affects how you perceive different events. You may hear the, I guess the wall settling and you may think it's footsteps. Because things like that do come into play uh, during paranormal events, paranormal activity. And that's something that, as investigators, you have to keep in mind is, you know, when you experience something and you first perceive it to be paranormal, what state of mind are you in? Are you already creeped out? So those are just some things to think about. The Clown Motel is one of those places I would love to investigate one day just to say I've been there, but I don't think I'd stay long.